Once there came a man to me and said, will you save my, my wife? She is arrested. She has saved Jewish people and now she is in a police station. And there is one policeman who will run the risk to set her free if we pay him 600 guilders. But I have no money. I said, oh man, what does money say? Let's see, I have 200 guilders. Come back after an hour. And in that hour I asked all my friends, say, have you money? Give it. It means to save the life of a good woman. When that man came back, I gave him 600 guilders. That man was a quisling, a betrayer. His wife was not at all in prison. But the Gestapo, the police of the enemy, had said, find out if Corrie ten Boom saves Jewish people. And he thought, I can do it and make some money. And he made some money. He went home with 600 guilders, but five minutes later the Gestapo surrounded our house and we were all arrested. Later, when I was in a concentration camp, there came a prisoner from my hometown. And she said, say, do you know who has betrayed you? I said, no. And then she told that it was that man. And there came hatred in my heart. The man I had given my last penny. But I know from the Bible that hatred means murder in God's eyes. And do you know, when I had b repented of that sin, the Lord, the Lord cleansed my heart with his blood. And a heart cleansed by the blood of Jesus, he fills with the Holy Spirit. And the fruit of the Spirit is love. Love even for enemies. And instead that I hated that man, I loved him. And after a war, that man was sentenced to death because he had caused the death of many Dutch people. And when I heard that, I wrote him, Your betrayal has meant the death of my old father, who was 84 years old when they brought him into prison. After 10 days he died. My sister, who died after ten months terrible suffering. My brother, he came out alive with a sick man and died through that sickness and his son never came back. I myself have suffered terribly through in three different prisons. But I have forgiven you. And that is because Jesus is in my heart. And when Jesus tells you to love your enemies, he gives you the love that he demands from you. And I sent that man a New Testament and underlined the way of salvation. And that man wrote me that you could forgive me is such a great miracle that I have said, Jesus, when you give such a love in the heart of your followers, there's hope for me. And I have read in the Bible that you sent me that Jesus has died at the cross for the sins of the whole world. And I have brought my terrible sins to Jesus and I know that they are forgiven. Your forgiveness has shown me what it means that there is forgiveness through Jesus Christ. And that man was brought to death that same week. But he was reconciled with God.